What's up, guys? I'm Vern. I'm Hunter. Welcome to another edition of Forty Boy Forty King Channel. So, Hunter, where are we? Jersey City. <laughs> Jersey City, our hometown. Yeah. Funny enough that we saw Manny walking around. Shout out to Manny, and he actually recommended this restaurant too. He's eaten here plenty of times. Mm -hmm. But uh, it's Vietnamese food, Hunter. You, you ready for some Vietnamese food? Sure. When was the last time you ate Vietnamese food? One or two weeks ago. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Kung Fu Pho. Kung Fu Pho. Yeah, they, they're pretty good too. Yeah. But uh, yeah, this one has um. I think it's a unique fusion of different types of sandwiches, yeah. of bannies. They, they're concentrating here more on sandwiches, but they do have other, you know, like, like regular food. food. Yeah, yeah, regular food type. But not as much, yeah, because it's still, they just opened up, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. they just opened up. Yeah. I think like last year. They used oh. to be behind a liquor store, mm -hmm. so this is a bigger space for them. So, anyway, guys, you, you hungry, Henry? Always. All right, keep watching. Yeah, Manny. Yeah. <laughs> That's why all their shades are down. Dirty Jersey. You got lucky here. Where'd you, where'd you park? The corner. Yeah, it's hard to find parking in Jersey City. Yeah, I saw that, I saw that parking place on my house. Jersey ban me. Look at that. Ban me, ban me, ban me. some Vietnamese coffee. I got my sweet because you know I'm a sweet guy. <laughs> of course Henry got thank you. Nice. Henry got the not sweet version. Not sweet uh, Vietnamese coffee. coffee. Looks good though. Oh yeah oh yeah oh it's leaking oh, oh, oh no it cracked oh shit tell them they can replace that Sweet Vietnamese coffee. Of course, we have to get some rolls. This is shrimp. And I think this is the peanut sauce, right? Yeah. Yeah. Classic. I think it's called Boy Kwan. I think. I might have put <laughs> <laughs> All right, we gotta try some of the spring, uh, the summer rolls. Spring, summer rolls. I call it spring roll. <laughs> summer roll. Well, if, if you know that, if you've eaten Vietnamese or before, this is no, you know, this is nothing new. Yeah. Your typical summer roll. Uh, yep. You got, typical clear, summer roll. you got the clear wrapping, so you can see what's inside. Yep. Totally different from the spring roll. So. Mm -hmm. Add some peanut sauce to it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, there's rice in there. Is that rice? Or noodles? Vermicelli noodles. Oh, vermicelli noodles, okay. Typical. Yeah. Summer rolls. Yeah, yeah. I think you need to add the sauce to give it some flavor. Right? Yeah, I don't want to double dip, so. Good? Good. Okay. I'll double dip it, so. Looks good though. All right. There you go. And that goes for 10 bucks. Mm -hmm. Then you could get it the, you could get the sausage version or the tofu. They have tofu. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. All right, I'll get the last one. Yep. Dip, baby, dip. <laughs> the peanut sauce, yep. Yeah, you definitely need that dip to make it taste even, you know, more mm -hmm. flavor because of the dip. Mm-hmm. 
But if you're not dipping the summer roll inside that peanut sauce over there, it's so bland. Yeah, it's a plain, it's like you're in a diet in this dish, right? Pretty much. <laughs> that gives it a flavor, so you need some peanut sauce. Yeah. It's a must. Yeah. Which is good. You got the shrimp right here. Look at that. We're in devouring that. Yeah. <laughs> Bulgogi cheesesteak. With that marinated beef bulgogi. I it think that's spicy though. meat. Yeah. yeah, Heather wants it. <laughs> yeah, it looks good. Look at the cheesesteak, but it's bulgogi and. I can uh, give you a piece if you want to try it. Kimchi. Yeah, I'll probably inside. just taste a little bit of the meat. Yeah, just yeah. a tiny bit. Looks good. I just wanted to taste the, the, how the bulgogi kimchi tastes. It looks pretty big size too for $60, so that's yeah. not bad at all. Turn, turn with a steak. kimchi cheese steak bulgogi. Oh, they already sliced it as yeah. always. But yeah, look at that. Plenty of meat inside. Bulgogi beef. beef. The taste of the bulgogi? No. Does it does it taste like your ordinary cheesesteak or there's a nice nice flavor to it because it's bulgogi? There's definitely nice flavor to it. I think it's the marination they use. There's some spicy mayo in there, so it's oh nice. It's a little kick. It's probably oh yeah, but oh, okay. It's pretty good though. Yeah, be, the kick is probably because of the kimchi. No, oh, and there's the kimchi, right? Yeah. It's nice. really good though. I think I would buy this again. Not bad though, like I said, for sixteen dollars for that size. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Something different too. Yeah. <laughs> Not bad. Uh, I think it's pork sausage inside, right? Yeah. I don't even know where the pork sausage is. I think it might be the oh, Vietnamese ham. Yeah, yeah, Vietnamese ham. So this is a different type of bun. Looks really good though. Yeah. But it's not as pleasant to look at as a cheesesteak, right, Hunter? <laughs> yeah, it's not as appetizing as a cheesesteak. I'll take a cheesesteak any day. I think it's big, though. It's a little big. It's the pork sausage. Oh, I see it. It's inside. Nice. Okay. Looks pretty good. Yeah. I would try it. I mean, you know. Yeah. Here's gonna try the banh mi. Look at that. Looks like there's plenty of meat inside, right? Huh? There's a lot of plenty of meat inside. There's a kick. There's a kick? So spicy. a little spicy, right? A little spicy. Huh. Wonder what it is. It's probably the um, jalapeno. It says it's jalapeno. The pork sausage probably. Oh yeah, there is jalapeno. Yeah. That's cilantro, pickled carrots. Daikon. Yeah. Radish sauce on a toasted baguette. Okay. But yeah, it is uh, it's spicy. It's spicy. How you talk? Probably, probably because of the jalapeno. <laughs> but yeah. I was like, what the? Why is he kicking? Yeah. I mean, you can always take it off, but it's not too, too spicy. You think, I mean, or you feel it? I feel it, but I can take it. Okay. Yep. It's pretty good. Okay. Yum. Half, I gave him my other half. Yeah, we switched sandwiches. <laughs> and I'm gonna taste the bulgogi, bulgogi kimchi cheesesteak. Yep. See. Tell me how amazing it is. You like it? Yeah? Yep, oh, there you go. Good. Thumbs up. It's different from a cheesesteak, for sure. Oh, definitely, because we taste the kimchi. The, um, the bulgogi marinade yeah. is there, mm -hmm. which is good. Yeah. And you know, they add a little cheese and onions in there. So yeah. Pretty much, yeah. You're eating bulgogi, but they're on the bread. That's why they call it. <laughs> yeah. Ah. I think this is the only place you can get it, unless someone else makes bulgogi kimchi nope. cheese steaks. Mm -hmm. So come to Jerry City. Right. It's good. Wait, hold on. Now it's Brain's turn to try the sandwich I picked. Yeah, this is the gulk 
with a uh, nem nom ban mi. Yeah, yeah. It's a different type of ban mi, pretty much. Okay. Yeah, ban mi. I think what ban mi means a sandwich. I yeah. Think. Yeah. yeah. Good. I like that they have pickles in there. Yeah. It's <laughs> or cucumber. Like cucumber, cucumber. Yeah. Cucumber. Some cilantro. Brand's favorite. Damn! I just licked something and I could really taste the spice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably from the jalapeno. <laughs> The juices, right? Yeah. Because the, my my other few times that um, I bit into it without jalapeno, it wasn't really that spicy. So. Yeah. Feel the kick of the jalapeno. Definitely can feel it. It's definitely spicier. Yeah. I think it's just because of the jalapeno, but I don't think the sausage or the. Um, what is it? The the ham is spicy at all. Or the sausage, yeah. Definitely, it's definitely the jalapeno. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, this is pretty good. Like, if you like banh mi. Yeah, not that for sandwich, something different, you know, from your ordinary ham and cheese. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Cheese steak. The bread has a nice crisp to it. Yeah. Nice, nice toasted. It's nicely toasted, yeah. yeah. But yeah, I recommend the sandwich. Not yeah, bad. Yeah, the sandwich is pretty good, yeah. I would go with you know the cheesesteak first, then before that one. Definitely, you have to go for the king. Yeah, yeah the cheesesteak. That's my recommendation too. Yeah. That one's still good, though. Mm -hmm. You know, don't get me wrong. Mm -hmm. Can't go wrong with cheesesteak. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, Heather, what do you think of the food? It's good, actually. Yeah, yeah for a sandwich. Yeah, uh, we actually spoke to, I guess the uh, one of the owners, and she they didn't have any desserts, but they will have more. I think yeah. they, they have not the, yet. Not They're yet. still, you know, fix, uh, finishing up their menus and stuff like that. They have yeah. supposedly uh, halo halo, which is a Vietnamese style. I'm looking yeah. forward to that. Yeah, it's probably just gonna be like shaved ice, <laughs> uh, Vietnamese style. So, yeah. and uh, anyway, we had the sandwiches. We had the banh mi's. What did you get, Henry? Uh, something with uh, the pork sausage. <laughs> on yeah, it. they don't have an English version for it. So. <laughs> it was a, I, I tasted it. It was pretty spicy. Like yeah. it started tingling in my mouth. I'm like, oh, <laughs> it's the jalapeno. <laughs> there, so. <laughs> Too much jalapeno. But it was pretty good. If you like spicy, and you like the banh mi, it's pretty good. Mm -hmm. uh, I also got the kimchi bulgogi cheese steak. That yep. was that was great. That was good. Yeah, I, I like recommend that. that. Highly recommend that one. Yep, yep. We also, of course, we got the summer rolls, which is summer rolls. Summer right? rolls. Yeah. yeah, you can't go wrong with summer rolls. <laughs> yeah. Add the peanut sauce. There you go. There you go. And I got something to go. You probably see a little video of that later. So this is the bag, Jersey Ban Me. Let's see what I got to go. Let's see what we're gonna eat today. I think I got the classic Ban Me sandwich. And ooh, what's in the box? Another one. This, these are actually gochujang wings so let's uh, give them a try the server suggested these to, to go so why not all right so this is the classic banh mi sandwich it's a classic staple for vietnamese food here you go i'm gonna cut it open see that um not sure what's inside but you'll see the the recipe and what's included in the sandwich but I'm pretty sure there's uh, some meat in there there's a uh, like yeah there's a lot of ingredients in here tomato I think that's carrot some carrot and some meat so let's take a bite mm. This one is extremely flavorful. There's a little crunch to it because of the cucumber and the carrots. Mmm. This is pretty good. It's not as spicy as the one that we ate earlier. So this is the classic. And um, I still prefer the cheese cheesesteak. But this is good. Love it. Try it. The classic bun mi. Okay, these are the gochujang wings. I know it's Korean, but he just suggested that I order these. They make them pretty good. And you know, Korean fried chicken. Can't go wrong with that, right? Got some, I think that's sesame seeds on it. 
give it a bite. Mmm. That marination in that chicken is excellent. It's not spicy. It's a perfect bite. And these are small. I got I got myself uh the flats and then you got your drums. So yeah. And I think there's uh one, two, three, four, five, six pieces of chicken inside the box. So um if you're a hungry man, you probably could eat two boxes, but for me, this is enough. Six is good, and uh, I'm gonna have myself a very good time with the chicken. <laughs> Thumbs up for me. Yeah, and we, we got the Vietnamese coffee too with condensed uh, milk. Yeah, the Vietnamese good. coffee. You got, definitely gotta try Vietnamese coffee. Yeah. Love it. But um, yeah, come down here. It's in Jersey City. Uh, it's Academy Street. Academy Street, yeah. yeah between Bergen Avenue and Academy Street. Yeah, yeah it's, it's a accessible to General Square. Yes, so if you're walking distance from walking General distance, Square. Yeah. So, not bad. It's a good place. Uh, they just opened up, so like I said, not, they're not, the menu is not too overwhelming, but there's enough there that they'll you know feed you for sure. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. And prices the price is decent prices. Decent prices, yeah, yeah for Jersey City. So yep. anyway, Henner, last words. Yes, please don't forget to comment, subscribe, and hit that bell button. Ding, ding, ding. See you guys. Bye.